Hi, I'm Yolanda from Gimmick Wrestling Tees, and I am back to give you Yolanda's WWE Total Divas Recap Season 2, Episode 2. Let's get going. Alright, the show opens up with Nikki and Bree sitting at a dinner table in a tent. And, uh, <laughs> and Bree on the phone with the agent talking about upcoming TV gigs and whatnot. Now, because of this phone call, we learned about his bra size, uh, let me see, dress size, pants size, and weight. We also learned that they give hot orgasm face. Who knew? Next scene, Nikki Boxes arrives at Cena's palace. Yes, palace. All 26 of them. And five of those boxes were full of vibrators. Which I know a lot of fans are hoping that she sells on eBay. Mr. Belding sighting, Mr. Belding sighting. Nikki finally tells Brie about Cena's elbow. Brie shows her support by kissing Cena's image on a truck. This is a divas match. Funkadactyls versus AJ Lee and Layla is, um, is shown right about this time. The match is over, the divas reunite, and in the back, Natty uh, says Naomi, that, uh, you know, I look forward to us wrestling again. I miss it. Blah, 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 blah. Except that one little thing. And Naomi tells Natty, next time, you better wear a diaper, girl. <laughs> that almost got my quote of the night. Mark plays, Mark shows up and, 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 and plays a very cruel joke on Ava and tells her that she will be announcing, she'll be ring announcing live on Raw. Cena reveals his balls on his elbow to the world on Raw and passes down all his responsibilities to Daniel Bryan. Now, Nikki and Cena with his plaid shirt and beautiful black eye is, is on a private jet and we find out that Nikki doesn't know where the ball sack is located. As he tries and tries and then constantly sounds stupid, Cena says, Public education has failed you. <laughs> Shade of it all. <laughs> Time for surgery. Cena, Nikki, and friend of somebody's at the, uh, what's the name? Dr. A Andrew Institute. During surgery, uh, this, the surgeon, you know, cuts Cena's ball sack open and uh, the, the operating room turns into a goddamn crime scene. I mean, there's blood everywhere. And it hits the curtain, it hits the light, it hits the doctor in the damn face. I know one thing when so when Cena revived, I was the doctor but looking for a damn tip. All that craziness all up in my face. Big Red finds out that Alicia Fox is the queen of the ums. Alicia Fox, you know, does what she usually does, laughs at people with expense and tells them they, they hope they don't get fired. Or everybody pees. <laughs> Look, I am convinced that Alicia Fox is put on this season just to laugh at people. <laughs> But you know what? I, I, I'm going to try my best not to hate or get mad, you know. Get it where you fit in, girl. Jig, hello. Jig, jig, hello. That, that is the, the, the song, the little ditty that uh, uh, Trinity and Cameron plays. Uh, it's, it's one of those ghetto games that those brown girls play uh, when we can't afford a jump rope. But whatever works, whatever works, whatever works. But Jay had to ruin the fun by busting his ass while these girls are saying while their mouth is all open. So his ass fumes is 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 like suffocating them. You, you know what I mean? Cause the funk and the mouth all open and then the ass fumes get caught up in the throat. You know what I'm saying? That 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 just that ain't right. That ain't right. You almost won that ain't right award, Jay, with your ass fumes all up in their throat. Just all up in their throat. But alas, you don't. We, I'm, I'm saving that for somebody else. So anyway, so Trini takes out her perfume bottle that looks like this. So she, <laughs> she tells Jay, turn over, turn over, so I can spray something in your ass. All up in your ass. <laughs> According to Ava, Randy Orton is from Los Angeles. Who knew? <laughs> Nikki and John are taking a car ride and cool points alert. John Cena pays homage to the Yin Yang twins and says that he skeet skeet. All the no surgeon faces. <laughs> oh, Cena, you know I love hate relationship with you, but that one earned you so much cool points you have no idea. Nikki's kissing Cena while driving and 
the hip hop woman in me thinks of a message bleak verse in that song is that your chick <laughs> uh, I do a thing get brown went Trinity and Jay are now in their apartment Trinity got on this nice bright neon number looking looking mm, delicious and Jay says you know looking girl look at you looking like a bag of skittles can I taste that rainbow and then they cut to them on the couch but I'm telling you I know in my heart of heart he grabbed all that ass you know he did you know after he said can I taste that rainbow mm, some family friendly things happened they can't show all that ass. Mm. anyhow uh, <laughs> I wrote in my notes, which I'm gonna say it anyway, that like I would love for somebody, I want for myself to figure out how to pay like a, a, a tribute to Trinity's ass. I'm, I'm serious. I love the fact that an ass like that is on WWE TV, and they can't tell her to lose her ass. They can't. What she, what she gonna do? Cut it off? Get an ass reduction? No, that ass is here to stay. Boom. All right. So J Toe is bleeding through his sock, and that is just gross. <laughs> Wait, hold, hold on. Eva, Eva, ring announce it wasn't a joke. This is real. Ooh, Jesus, take the wheel. Lord, no, Lord, no. Mm -mm -mm. Well, she looked gorgeous. Her voice was horrible. <laughs> she should probably. <laughs> I would say she should probably never announce again, but actually that's not true. I really don't feel that way at all. Um, so she announces the Usos and Justin Gabriel. I mean, you can tell she was nervous. You know, who wouldn't be nervous, to be honest with you, unless you were, you know, made for that. Or, pra or practice a lot, but whatever. <laughs> but when it's time to announce 3MB, she, she announced Heath Slater, but she forgets Jinder Mahal and Drew McIntyre. <laughs> <laughs> poor this poor girl can't catch a break, can she? So anyway, so Eva, she finally mans up. She goes to find 3MB to apologize. And while she's apologizing, Gender does her best not to throw her ass down the hall. Jay's bloody foot is out of control. But Dr. Truth is to the rescue. Again, oh no! Hello, nurse. Nikki. Nikki Bella is dressed in this, this very, very, very cute, sexy, and extra nurse outfit. It is so adorable with her boobs all poked out. I remember, remember, remember in my first episode when I, when I, well, I thought of something that I didn't say. That might be it. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just, it's going to happen. And I will pay for it. That stank toe gotta go. That is the quote of the night that Naomi, not Naomi, I mean, I want to call her Trini, that Trinity said to Jay, because that, that toe was fucking, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> I, I edited it, it's going to keep going. It was gross. That joint was nasty. Jay finally goes to the doctor, and we find out that, uh, unfortunately, Jay gave Trinity the toe touch. Trinity slaps in the back of the neck. <laughs> <laughs> and she gets mad to fix her stink toe. In this scene, Nikki is taking over the closet with all them fabulous shoes. And they were fabulous. They were fab. I, I peeped it. I put paws. And, and I looked on them shoes. But bad news Cena ruins the fun by giving Nikki, uh, handing Nikki to sign this cohabitation agreement. Uh, and in order for her to to officially move in here she has to she so you know she has to, she has to sell her soul I mean she has to sign this piece of paper three times and then get it notarized <laughs> and in the agreement it says basically if he tells her you know to, to get the F out you gotta bounce for 40 hours or the nice way is to vacate the premises he, Nikki asks you know Cena why didn't you tell me this before before I packed all my vibrators he said that it slipped his mind. Slipped your mind. <sighs> At this point, Nikki should have slapped him right in the back of his bowl cut and dramatically left the house. Instead, she leaves quietly, cries in the car, while Cena looks like a member of a boy band about to sing a love song. 
Sorry, come on, come on. I, I know I ain't the only one that after they saw that that sunlight hit them all angelically, 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 whatever the fuck you want to, damn, cursed again, sorry. Uh, <laughs> in the window. I ain't the only one that thought Backstreet Boys. Come on. I, I, I can't be, I can't be, I can't be the only one. You know, am I not the only one? Maybe, you tell me, you leave a comment or two. Anyway, that's the end of the show. The You Ain't Right Award goes to John Cena because, not because he gave her that piece of paper, because I can understand why he didn't, why he gave her that piece of paper. He's been through some stuff. So I get why he gave it to her, but the way he gave it to her was effed up. He couldn't think of a smoother way to, 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 to do that. Like, did he think that she was so manly in love that she would just say, baby, I will sign anything just to be with you and not think that she has some type of strength in a mind of her own that she, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, this ain't right. This, this hurt my feelings. Um, yeah. oh, oh, and in the paper it said that we, that, that, uh, what did he, what was it, a visitor? Oh man, I can't find my notes. Uh, 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 um, not a visitor. What, what is she? A roommate? A roommate. A roommate. He, they couldn't find a better terminology, but to call her a roommate. You wrong. You is he was all kinds of you, all kinds of wrong. You <laughs> horrible, straight up and down horrible. Um, <laughs> I guess I should end. I should end end the show that way. Um, let me stop almonds. So I don't want to be like Alicia Fox. So I actually did this way. Uh, what do you call that? Way faster than I did, than I did the first show. So, probably because I got notes. I had all these notes. I had cue cards and all types of good stuff. And I did my best keeping my head up, which I'm pretty happy about. So, I hope you enjoyed uh, my recap of Total Diva Season 2, Episode 2. My name is Yolanda with Gimmick Wrestling Tees. Check out all of my t-shirts at Gimmick Wrestling Tees. Recently for pre-order is Devastation Corporation, AR Fox, and Stan Styles t-shirts. So, go check that out. Uh, follow me on Twitter at Gimmicks247. Leave a comment, but like I said before, if you come at me crazy or say something out of pocket down below in the comment box, don't think I won't say nothing back. I'm tell you right now. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I do like to sell merchandise, but I ain't gonna sell my soul to sell no merch. And you come at me crazy. Er, so, uh, <laughs> my name is Yolanda. I'll be enjoyed by a shirt or two, like this classic heel one, and uh, well, I'll be back next week. Bye. Or deuces. I, mean, I, should, I, I should do jail poses like Vinny did the last episode. <laughs> Good night, everybody.